I'm now going to attempt to put the a new transistor in to replace the one that has been the most I've uh, got an active static strap and um, I've got pliers which are earthed on the wire very simply and it should be a nice and static thread but nothing must fall off but it's Bodge up for me. So I go But uh, I guess you better ask to do it first. It's all bonded down to earth. And the, and the gate is on one mega, one mega resistance to it. So it shouldn't be that. So we're going to need the wire. Now I've to replace the metal plates by uh, copper, normal pretty circuit board copper. So now I have to, uh, I'm going to tin the, tin the transistor first. I had several attempts to put it on before, and this piece of glass rather, so it shouldn't, it shouldn't be anything. It shouldn't block it this way. Turn it over. Drop it over. Real to practice, you know, putting it on. I'm going to tin, tin the back now before I heat up the uh, junction of the, the, the joint. So the soldering iron is, is actually not a. That's the problem. Soldering iron is not a. So I'll just touch it so it's first. Because I could put an open bar. Time. So, the essential conductor is there, so I touch that on there. Touch that on there. That's right. It should be that. It's a good time. It doesn't have to be the earth conductor as long as it's the same conductor. That's kind of the solder now. So that should bond on the equation. Now I've got a way of putting it on the equation. Now I've got a way of putting it on the equation. What I did before is use a blowtorch, which I have to use again. It's not worth that much time. But it's a much lower temperature because it's a much thinner bit of copper. So I'm not sure just that way. I'm going to practice putting it on. So I'm practicing. I've got to practice, but uh, the first time I did, I had three goes before I got it on. It was only when I tried to put it in the circuit and I forgot the old mega resistor that it blew up. Now I get the blow torch now. I've got to be careful not to, I'm not quite sure whether I've got to put it that way, stop it. Uh, Damage, it's a real problem that silver paper which is standard for doing things I want you earthed. So this is a bow torch. It's an old it can be used for paint stripping, which is probably what you I've got a smaller one, I've got a smaller one. So I'll get at least a small one, less dangerous. I've got a smaller one which is uh, far less dangerous. It's a vast, it's more a sixth of the area, is it? Here, but I find it. It's quite small. It uses uh, butane gas, which is standard. It's kind of butane gas. So it has to uh, 
play out the joint just long enough to know so you just have to experiment. Now it takes the wheel back. It is floating now. And that's motion. Okay, that's that's all it takes. Now that's much better than before. It took ages to happen before, so we'll forget that. Get this ready to push on. This is not very solid, really, but I'm trying to do a very solid joint. Drop it. Very solid joint without the facilities of very solid. And of course, these things are probably, probably very expensive, which I couldn't possibly afford. It seems to be amateur way of doing it. And I have to heat it up without destroying the printer so that you can make With the big metal block, it retain the heat. It's not very good. I think I'll leave this already last. Leave this already last. Might be a bit more gentle. So, uh, yeah. I don't think this thing is going to I'm quite sure what to do because the, the other way is melted, it's actually burning through the copper underneath, which is not a very good idea. So uh, that's that seems to be that. So I'll take that off. And uh, move it elsewhere. Move it back to the table. And uh, I'm sure what the sorry are is on still a little surface. It's gone like he's gone through the copper. I'm sure I have to do this because it's very difficult. I use heat guns on And the cell seems to oxidize the oxidizer at our bearing, so it's probably not sure it would be very good here. Is it going right through? Sure. Yeah, it's going right through. Ah, it's gone through the, through the copper. That's bright, isn't it? It's gone right through the copper underneath. Ah, that's no very good number, it's so good. I'll have to replace that copper. I'm going to have to do that. Hmm, problems. Problems. There's still plenty of copper there, but if we... That was a disaster. Got through the copper. The flame was too hot. Get that. So it's back to back with its bag. Yeah, that wasn't a good idea. I have to put a bit of metal on it. A little bit of metal. And this again. Oh, that's not back in the bag. I just had it back there. What should I use as a metal block? I don't know. So these metal blocks are heavy, too heavy to put on. I might put one of those on to the back. This one there. Very heavy. That would do. It might work quite well. Because it's, uh, it can take the heat. And these things can't. So that goes on there. Like that. Much thicker one, Jude. It would probably um, makes it much higher up. So it's not really a good surface. So. What else can I just think that a copper copper plate I might have to strip some of the copper off a circuit board or something like this. I think. Not sure what to do. That a failure. Always goes wrong first time. Always. Don't worry about it. Always goes wrong first time. I, mean, I should have realised it. I, don't, I thought it I thought it might burn through, but there's a bit of copper here, a bit of copper here, so it's nice. I'm just a question myself. 
Here they are, so they are so good. Probably oh, isn't that true. Let's see if it is fresh from the other copy. And um, this could do. I'll glue it on the surface. Clean off the uh, clean off the uh, this is much thinner than the copper I had underneath. I can't take the copper off when it's glued down. So it wasn't a good idea, so I have to take off the copper the, the, the solder. I've got a solder remover, so just have to take off the solder the best I can. And um, get rid of it. And uh, it's gone right through, gone right through. So that's not good. Put this on. Now this I'll glue this on. Glue this on. Glue this on. Glue this on. The idea is that was done separately, wouldn't it? That was put on that, and then that put on that. That might work better. I'm trying to get it on straight away. So I can put this here. And put the transistor on this. Instead of trying to hang it on all the things at once, and the two little metals could go together, and uh, and that'll make it a two-stage process instead of one. It wouldn't have to be in exactly the right place, which would be well, the major problem. So could be put on the whole bit of metal and then used up the other bit of metal. It's all good before. Boom. And then that'll be glued down, but it's. Uh, You do it down, it separates, it makes it static. That's where you don't sort of set that down in the branch. And I solder that and see if I can get that to go on. Let's take this off. It's a separate bit of board on there which uh, will be moved about after you put it on. Now I have to uh, put some solder on there. I somehow arrange that, but I have to put this little tab sitting out like right? it's sufficient to do it. So I'm just put a little bit of solder on there. Yeah. That's what it is. And I'll pick up the chip, which is there, and see if I can get it in place. I mustn't drop. Any of you mustn't drop it, you drop it. That's standard. You mustn't touch it very much. It could be if you touch it, it blows up. I don't know. But it is. I'm always sealed down, so I don't know. I'll it probably blow out. I don't know. The lands are coming. I'm trying to. 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 I'm just going to be heated up. I'm going to be melting now, so it's going to be hot. Excuse me. Let's see what happens. 
should check. I don't know where I'm from. What shall was it just through the copper block? I should just look at it. I'll try to shine a photo, try and chip it for the metal that burned me past it. Can't do that. No good. No good at all. Should be, yeah, see a bit of stuff. You get a good time to see this stuff. You see, it's a good mechanical gun. Good. Now I've got to stick it down the other part. Now that's difficult. I'm going to put a wire now between the two bits because otherwise it will be static. I'm going to put a connection one for the other current. This is the next stage. This is the first stage. It's not very mechanically sound, but it will screw with it. It looks very mechanical. It's going to be the same. It's going to be very much because I've touched it. But, uh, not necessarily because if I'm on earth, do I? I'm not really. Good. I actually used to sell with a copper plate. I actually used to use commercially design now. And now it's the next stage is to do an etching. It's typically, it's the point is getting it onto the chip, onto the, it's, it's in the, in the, it's very sorry, it's done with a machine. And you have to get the thing hot enough so you can put it on. And so you can get other answers of copper plate. Eating devices are so hot. It's going to be a question mark. It should be nice with copper. Now that's now one to that. That's now safe. Okay, so that's now reasonably safe. I can take this off and put it on there. That's now one to that. Now that goes all the way up to there. Okay, so now and those problems are going to be bent down. That will go back to there. And uh, it's going to be pushed down the solid. I'm going to do that, I don't know. Let's get my CC. No, I'm going to think about it. Let's see. I'm going to put that down. So first of all, to get some solder on the solder there. You can't see what it is. This stuff is going to be a tremor. Here we go. It's going to be a good idea to go. It's going to be a terrible tremor in my hands. Now 
have two ends of slope and the gate is now sold to them. So the heat of the reduction is not as it that's that. All right. That's going to go. That other one's going to go over there. I'm going to put that there. It's going to be pushed over there without doing damage. Or the gate on. Oh, no artistic man in this video can't see me. There's a door here in front of me. I'm going to put that uh, gate on without blame. So I need a razor blade to put it out into the right position so it sits. I think I'm trying to raise up that razor blade somewhere. I'm still going to clamp the high current cam on it. I'm going to do that, which is going to bend over. It might work. I nearly killed myself, didn't I? Nah. There you go, myself. I don't know what I'm going to do. It might work, it might bend over. Not breaking. Honestly, let's see. What is it? I'm just going to sort of watch that again. It takes a lot of soldering, I suppose, make it more comfortable. I'll buy it a little bit. That's a very sort of separator. That's a stretch of the second one. That's a very sort of separator. To do things you forget to put the resource in this, uh, this um, strap on the next. And this one protects it from fire, which it protects the chip from fire. Mm -hmm. Works. I have to do it with the other low voltage first to see if the chip is blown. Yes, it has. I have to get another chip with them. Because they're not really so I'm trying to do that quite a while with them. It's not on postage. That's all right. That's all right. Mm -hmm. Mm
Guys, I wish you guys, guys, is so much for the time that I survived. We were really against Brian up. We were moving about. It was difficult to get in about just a tiny thing. We did the right position. Yeah. Yeah. Which is usually the way people with deformities which are actually put there by an eye. It doesn't make a difference to them for some people. But to most people, it doesn't matter. They can get used to know them. They can put the illness down. Do it differently, I'm not quite sure how to do that. I've got the chip down, I can try it on six volts. I'm not going to turn them, so I'm going to put the turn them clicks on. It's a real problem, you see, it's a real mess, because I couldn't get it off the right place. It was a mess in the first place. That stuff. I think I'll take off that, that extra strap and uh, put it on the one underneath and just hope I get the right connection. You don't have to be sent off again, but I'll be fine with that one. Just a few minutes to go. It's not going to be so I'm not going to put that up. It's got some something. Oh, yeah. I was going to go down to the bottom one now. That was in the wrong position. Gave me a hot, so I could have blown the chip, but it's uh, 
real problem with these chips are actually so sensitive, it's probably about a chip, but it's too hot. You have to reach very high temperature. Just get out. Experience to this, and I have to gain experience now to get it properly. It should only be completed for 30 seconds, so if you gain performance, I'm not surprised. This is done professionally, that was completely simple. I can't do it. And the technology. Next up. Don't go to them, it's pretty well work. Test it now. To, uh, it's actually a very poor point of view. It's only got it to the edge. If we have got some sound box in the house. So if I've got Mars or Solar underneath, that would be Solar. Time for Solar underneath. Solar underneath. It's called Gap. Gap putting Solar. Ship gets hotter and hotter. I don't know what that's a tune of that It's a very poor job. Must have been. It's a very poor job. I'm going to drill a hole now. I'm going to take this off and tell these chips out there. That's right. Earth breathing. Playing chips. Too hot. If it's brown, as it's done, if it's black, it's done. Don't really. My soldering is not to be desired. It's always the case with the other constructions. You've got the theory, but you better have a skill man to do it. I did have some of the other skill man, but they took them away. So the reason was pretty good in their job. Put him into a job and so he works. That's right. I'm now going to put the the heat sink on the top, which will take all the air down. But we still test it. Low temperature. So I'm going to That's that thing was far too hot. Far too hot. And there's, there's the heat sink. There it is. It's a very poor job. Very poor job. Really is. 
شاه و بلاشتم شاید خود از اگر شاید نام را اون را شاید هم و اون پاکری هش برنام شیزا جنجیش یعنی باشی ایده پر باش پر با بچه برنیت ایده شاید نام شیزا برنام I didn't put that wall on for some of these. Anyway, actually, that's how I'm going to put the heat sink on. It's the first time done it, so it's not surprising. You know, when you have 10,000 of them, you get used to it. It's a kind of experience, and you find out all the things that go wrong. And just to wait, it, you can't. That's the problem. Always with these things, you have the experience, and that's painful to make mistakes. I was extra expensive when I was teaching because I found that. You just have to accept that they break things and drop things and, and basically the rest of the mess of it. And, uh, I have to be taught. It likes to have to learn it from such a kind of teaching, really. You know, they can tell them, but I don't know. And you also have to do it as you're supposed to do it. You know, you I don't know what to do it. These, these, this epoxy version, a tiny bit of spin, I think. I'll put it on somewhere, put it on the on the so I can say it's safer. So I can put it like that. And uh, so yeah, tiny amount. And that will take ages to see that could be. It might take ages to see. And this was in there very very square. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. Huge amount, huge amount. Let's put it again. Let's put it out with a bunch. So, so that. Now let's put it out here, which is much smaller now. Here is the catalyst. You're going to mix it up together. It's going to stick. And you stick it on. You leave it there until it comes. And this is not fully as good as the full curve. That's it, that's right. That's a tiny bit. It's some use epoxy resin before. This top I haven't met before. Now I'm going to mix it together. Well, it sets. It takes a few hours to set, so I don't know what about that much about this. I use this in the rod. Mix it up. And it's a heat conducting resin, that's the important thing. And one of the catalyst is. White is blue and white, I think, and the resin is blue, so I can easily see it mixed together. Okay, it's up now. It's mixed up now. Look at this back in this case. Obviously, it's mixed up with something else. That's not good. So I'll put that one. That's right now. Go on the chip. This, hopefully, that one. And we'll blow that up. It's a terrible job of putting it on. And we'll blow that. I'm going to leave that now until it's cured. Take some time. I don't, as I say, I could test the currents on it, but I don't think I will. Because it's probably going to really cool down first. The, 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 the downshot is eroded by it, it isn't destroyed immediately, it's eroded. I'm saying they're not totally destroyed. The chances are I would have done it, it's been on for a long time. And I am aware of it, but I could have done it. Either way. Okay. I wish I had somebody who could do it for me. Contractors would do it, but they charge three times a day. They pay for their skills. I did have somebody, but they basically took them away. And I always took them to you, actually. In fact, they were doing the drugs. Just shut them up. I know, I've never seen some, you know, the new. Yeah, see, Tesla is a, in this country, if you talk about Tesla, it's illegal. If I talk about it, a transfuser, which is legal. Transfusers are legal. It's not a Tesla thing. In fact, I don't know what Tesla is, so. Holding a transfuser is better, so I'm going to change the name back to transfuser. It's actually a corruption of transformer and fuser. Well, fuser is the technology of the fusion machine, which is high voltage beams of uh, beams. And um, that's what it is. So I'm now going to no, just stop that recording now. Stop the recording. Now I'll leave, I'll leave that 20 or 48 hours until I get it uh, to set. So I'll be just a I think it was actually not as long as that, it was four hours.